What's going on YouTube is Rashad from Sneakers NBA Music, the channel back up at it to do this video. Uh, it's a sneaker pickup uh, slash review and I'm really, really excited about it. Um, I promised you this pickup in my last video and um, it's a pickup, you know, I've been anticipating ever since I seen the images drop on sneaker blogs and all that. Uh, release date was today, the 31st, you probably know, you know what it is. Uh, picked these up from Foot Action. Retail was 170 with tax around 185, so it is a pricey sneaker, at least in my opinion. Um, um, I picked these up um, regular, just walked in, I got them around two o'clock in the afternoon, and um, you know I was really nervous about getting these at that time. You know I was debating on here, do I need to go early? Do I need? I mean even have to camp? I mean I don't, I didn't know. I mean the way sneaker the sneaker world is going right now it's like every sneaker that drops that has a fancy name to it you need to camp out for it. but you know i was like nah you know i think I, I think i have a chance of finding my pair i have a lot of sneaker places around me so if foot action didn't have them i would have had a lot of other places to go to luckily foot action i went to had them had a lot of pairs left i was really glad and by now if you don't, don't know what i'm talking about it is a lebron 9 and it is the lebron 9 hornet um Again, retail 170. Uh, the official co the official color is purple, turquoise, and blue and white. Um, this is a size 10 and a half. And guys, when I tell you these are dope, I mean these are dope. When I first seen these in person, man, when I walked into the store, I was like, damn. Just, just look at that sliding out the box. Honestly, on camera, these look dope. On camera, these are freaking awesome. But they still don't do the shoe justice on how bright, how intense this shoe is. This is probably the definition of a summer shoe, guys. Like, really? If you're watching this right now on the 31st, you really need to go out there to your foot actions and see if they still have a pair because I these are dope. Probably in the running for the dopest LeBron 9. And there's a lot of LeBron 9s out there that are really freaking hot. But these definitely are up there. I mean, in my opinion, they're up there with the Big Bangs, they're up there with the, with the, you know, the Cannons, the Chinas, you know, my personal favorite LeBron 9 are the Cannons, but these right here, guys, these are nice. Uh, let me just give you guys a quick review of the shoe, okay, uh, you know, again, with the LeBron 9, you have that flower wire, hyperfuse technology combined within the shoe, uh, you have all over the shoe, a uh, nice bright purple, and then you have hits of turquoise blue right here on the check. Which I do not know if it's 3M. I do not think so. I think uh, I can't really tell right now. I have to look into that. I do not believe if I don't know if these Nike checks are 3M, but most of LeBron 9 checks are 3M. I do not know. I'm sorry for that. But um, again, then you have this turquoise finishing on the bottom of the shoe with pink splattering, which I think is really nice. Uh, detailing uh, featured in the LeBron the mangoes that had that pink pink splattering. You have your purple carbon fiber plate, which is pretty dope. Uh, on the bottom, your normal traction, like every LeBron 9, hits a white all over. Uh, then the turquoise, then the you know the LeBron James logo with the king there. On the bottom, dope as hell. You have the, the little Charlotte Hornets logo, which is I think a summer league that LeBron played for. Uh, then you have your little pull tab with the nine right there. Uh, inside the shoe, uh, you have LeBron James's logo, and it's uh, tor all turquoise out inside. Uh, the tongue uh, has his um, signature. Uh, basic purple lacing. Uh, a lot of people, um, a lot of people um, wanted the shoe to come with a turquoise lacing, as did I. Uh, I, I thought okay, should I came with another pair of laces, but uh, they didn't. But nonetheless, it's still a dope shoe. Uh, another cool is uh, another cool little detail is they have these turquoise uh, lace tips that say uh, LeBron James on them, and. Uh, Hit a turquoise on the logo here on the laces on your toolbox. Uh, on um, then you have your Air Max bubble here in the back for support. And overall, a dope shoe. It is the uh, Hornet colorway, basically turquoise and purple. Uh, that's basically it. But the shoe, they they really did do a good job. When you see these in person, they're really bright. Bright. The colors are there and the quality is there. LeBron Nine really. Not even LeBron 9, but LeBron's in general over the past years, ever since the 7s, have shown us they're gonna, they put out quality good shoes, you know what I'm saying, um, 
And uh, people, you know what I'm saying, you guys gotta stop sleeping on, you know, these other Nike uh, releases if you're just stuck on Jordans. I mean, there are a lot of other stuff that, you know, you can be looking into like LeBron's. LeBron's really nice alternatives for, like, sneakerheads. Uh, LeBron 9's really doing their thing right now. Um, I know these are the last um, hot top LeBron 9's that we'll be releasing. After this will be the LeBron 9 lows, and then you'll see the LeBron 9 um, elites, which are also nice, both of those. Uh, I am planning to try to get the either the Easter KDs or the Easter LeBron 9s. I don't know which one I'm going to get, but hopefully I can get those next week and do a video for you guys. But, final thoughts. LeBron 9 Hornet, must, must, must cop. If you haven't copped already, run to your sneaker store, wherever you live, and get them. Because these are sexy as hell. Let me give you a last look. I don't really. It just, it just doesn't, it doesn't, do it, doesn't do it justice cameras you need to get them but uh thanks for watching guys rate subscribe comment and uh stay tuned for the next video peace